today in Acta Sanctum's XCOM Squad. Well, we finished with our motion scanner research and have begun uh, alien biology, one step at a time. We definitely want to start capturing aliens alive as soon as possible. Our next facilities still have a ways to go, and of course we have detected another UFO. It's grounded. I'm hoping we can get there before it lands and also before nightfall. It looks like we'll get there before nightfall, and it took off. Well, can't have everything, I guess. Now, we should have just about the same complement as before. And once again, we are looking at a corner here. I forgot to prime the grenades beforehand. Ouch. This could have been a serious problem in a different situation. Oh well. Well, since there aren't any aliens in that direction, I guess I can save the people in the Sky Ranger some stun damage. No, I, no, I can't. Because this guy is still overloaded. fighting you might be in trouble although the second smoke grenade should save you from any horrible accidents oh looks like you haven't moved around much this would be a problem if I was worried about reaction shots current situation, I'm really not. Okay, let's see if you can land a shot or two. Well, you had your chance. Yep. In classic XCOM, everyone has squad sight. Ah, looks like we spied you just in time. fire. Let's see if we can make one. Looks like we can. <sighs> Although it might not matter. Well, let's see if you have a line of fire. No, wait, no. It should come from someone else. I just kind of wish that wasn't his very last movement. Oh well. You need to move aside a bit. 
because we're gonna try us some shotgun sniping. Aw. Oh, I think I know why. I suppose I can only hope that the alien's aim is as bad as ours, unlikely as it might seem. From here, it seems likely that I'd shoot squad mates in the back. Huh. That's extremely odd. Well, you two get a second try. And a third try. Okay. You know what? Instead of wasting more ammo, I'm gonna give Lance his, uh. or Rance, whatever. Because that's really what I should have been doing in this kind of fight in the first place. There we go. Now, spreading out the shots like that. It's not all bad, it, but it is some bad. As I mentioned before, landing one shot does uh, increase secondary stats. And for that purpose, landing one and only one shot is the most efficient way because anything else doesn't increase them further. But to increase firing accuracy, you need three for a guaranteed upgrade. You need to back up quite a bit. Is there an angle from here? If so, I should probably be scared. They seem oddly reluctant to shoot at my scout even though they can see it. Alright, I'm gonna try for three on, Al on Alicia. Just to see if If this doesn't land... I'm fairly sure I wasn't aiming for that three... for that tree. Uh. I gave you all the time in the turn to aim that shot. I was hoping for better. I'm fairly certain that the shotgun gets some accuracy fall off. There we go. Uh 
Aha. And it's back is to us. Good going. All right, Dreamscape, it's up to you. <sighs> Not a bullet too soon. of it I don't see anything on this side so should be okay to send one of us in anyway. Yeah that's what I thought. Alright most likely it's in that small room. Time to move forward. Or not. Wow. Will it reaction fire? Only one way to find out. Mm, maybe I should kneel. Well, I suppose there's good news and bad news from that. The good news is that's his third shot. Bad news, someone else has to take another shot. Hooray! Uh, now, you might be suspicious that ever since I picked non-Iron Man, I've done two missions in a row without any uh, deaths. I swear I haven't been starting any missions over yet. Trust me? Hello and welcome to XCOM. And I mean that because we've got a terror mission. Alright. I th think under the circumstances I'll have to prime high explosives ahead of time even though I really hate doing that. Horrible danger to the squad. But I don't know what's gonna be here. And now I do know what's going to be here. Oh boy. So, sectoids. Not so much a problem in UFO salvage missions. In a terror mission though, that means they brought their terror unit. We will see those entirely too soon. Well, that was a big explosion, wasn't it? The good news is, since we didn't all die there, it was clear that was a stun bomb. Uh, which will be extremely useful when we research that, but it won't. that will not happen for a long time. Also, I really should have put down smoke with my uh, scout vehicle first. That, because either of those reaction shots could have been a huge problem. Well then. The sort of situation we're looking at right now where the Sky Ranger is likely to be surrounded. Oh, 
And that is what I was worried about. That's the cyber disk. Unlike the Reaper, it has ranged weapons, very accurate, powerful enough to defeat powered armor, never mind what I've got right now. And... That guy was probably shot through the window. Well, Mr. Lee, here's your chance to get some shot growth if you don't die horribly along with the rest of the squad next turn. Well then, that definitely came from this direction, but I can't see anything, which is very concerning. After all, this is not a night mission. Aha. Uh -huh. Well then. <sighs> I learned the hard way that small rockets are not effective against these things. Normally I prefer small rockets because they are, first of all, you can carry more of them, and secondly, they're much less dangerous to allies. The Cyberdisc survived a direct large rocket hit. Well, this is why I primed this high explosive beforehand. Also, do you have a shot against this? <coughs> Technically, not anymore. You probably need to move out from under the Sky Ranger to have a decent throw. Well, this is awkward. Can you throw this far? No. It is very unlikely that you'll take down the cyber disk with this. On the other hand, if you survive, your uh, accuracy should grow quite nicely. Normally. Wait, there's another one? Oh, is there ever? I think we will need more smoke. Oops, did not mean to fire that other one. Anyway. Yes. That is roughly what it takes to defeat. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, mystery solved. It's okay, it's okay. We haven't taken a horrible death yet. We haven't even taken a reasonable death. Oh, wow. How did I not see that one before? Good thing I did, though. Holy crap. Right, Yuki. You need. You probably need to close in to reduce that accuracy penalty for the shotgun. It's 
Still didn't work. The alien does not seem to be impressed. Can you move? No, you can't. Well then, let's hope you're good at firing over things. Whoa. Turns out you are. Hooray. That could have been really bad. Let us pray. Well then. Take a knee and don't miss. Well, you didn't miss, so there's that. Also, did that did that cyber disk really just use hit and run tactics? Because that is extremely annoying to me. Okay. One step at a time. Oh, but there are a lot of you around, aren't there? Kinda need to hit that, didn't I? Well, that happens a lot. Kinda need to hit that too. It's okay. We still have some shots left. This is why it's very important to always have backup. Okay, good. It looks like... The Cyberdisc could not see us through all that smoke. Hooray! This time the large rocket worked. That's two discs down, and Roxas will have to go back to reload. That's okay, Rance will step out and pick things up where you left off. Okay. I have a couple of backup plans just in case my first attack doesn't work. For now, Rance, aim and fire. Well, that did the trick. Of course, there won't be any alien artifacts around there to retrieve because too many explosions, but. I cannot bring myself to care right now. Oh wow. There's still more of you, huh?
Way to defy the odds, my friend. It's okay, Meme Hammer is here to save the day. And he was shot through the window, wasn't he? Uh. Nice shooting. Well, that's a relief. Uh, I did not want a soldier as good as Rance to uh, get killed. The rest I didn't care about. Well, okay, I cared a little bit. I have to, I'm a guild leader. Ah, you can see it. I don't really know how. Maybe the smoke is thinner in that direction. which means you better get back into cover. Alright, Roxas, do you have a shot? No. Can we make a shot? Yes, it looks like we can. That did the trick. Aha! Our early alien detection system seems to be working quite well. I'm amazed, now that I know what it is, that it missed that civilian. <coughs> I may have a line of fire from here, though I can't aim shot that way just yet. You definitely need to get some distance and not be near windows. Curse that corner system. I need to see this. Uh. There you are. Right, this could go horribly wrong easily. And that is only one of the ways. Now, you are out here alone for reasons unknown to me. I was certain that I brought someone else. A lot depends on this. I'm going 
just hope. Against reason that the cyber disc was damaged enough for me to uh, take it down with normal weapons after that. Yeah, it didn't work. Yeah, this is definitely start over time for me. <laughs> No, you know what? No, I'm not going to start over. Unless, of course, I can't even make this throw. tempted to start over though, but you know, looking back on it, I think I'm gonna go through with this because honestly, four casualties in our first terror mission against this terror mission in particular, and well, I'll pull through. though. It really does. Well, it's not XCOM without pain, I suppose. And, well, the good news is I'll be able to add the names of some people who requested them. So, hooray, I guess? Also, thank you, Roxas Chaos. You are, uh, the hero of the terror mission, I think. 